It's boys the cross semifinals. Red line in Central York at Dallas Town. You got to defend the left against Jack Goley of the Lions. Well, he gets left and he gets the scoring started to make it one nothing early. Red Lion. Central York goaltender Luke McLaughlin turns it on and becomes a wall with not one, but two saves from point blank range. He was like that all game. Central York's offense then. Dayton Bagwell with an absolute laser puts the Panthers up 3 to 2. They're going to win 11 7. The other semifinal, New Oxford, the underdog against the top seed Susquehannock. Warriors in white, and they add to their lead to start the third period. They attack up the middle, connects with the attacker that cuts in front of the net. Senior Ben Tomasic finishes for a 9 2 advantage. A few minutes later, a fast break. Again, they go to the middle. On the doorstep is junior Tristan Coleman. He scores. Susky cruises to the title game 17 7. A barn burner in the girls' league semi, Southwestern in black, Susquehannock in white. Six minutes left, tied at seven. Mustangs junior Lexi Plesic in traffic, rips it near side for an 8 7 lead. Warriors come right back. Isabella Vogel off the free position. Stick to the face, no matter. Still gets the goal down low. Now tied with just over two minutes left. After a Susky stop on D, under 20 seconds left. Addison Router free position sneaks it in. That's the game winner. Nine, eight Warriors is the final. Router with ice in her veins. I'm just hoping that I make it because our team has worked so hard to get to this point, and I'm so proud of all of them, and I just didn't want to let them down. So Router and the Warriors face rival York Catholic in the finals on Friday. Fox 43 News returns after this.